The sun is a truly remarkable source of energy. Do you know that in one year, the earth receives enough energy from the sun to cover the current need of energy for our globe for 10,000 years? We are of course not able to harvest all that potential energy, even if we wanted to, but it illustrates the potential of sunshine as a natural and clean source of energy, and South Africa is blessed with a lot of it. I really think this is one of the most um, impressive, you know, the renewable energy programs uh, globally. I mean, South Africa has really taken a, a pioneering role. You know, we're only three years uh, going into this program and already solar power is cheaper than uh, new build coal. Affordability is very important for the South Africans and, and for the program. So uh, that is sort of, a, I think, accomplished beyond sort of anyone's wildest imagination. That Norway and South Africa is as far apart as you can possibly get it in a north-south context, make this a bit special. I'm so happy we're here once again opening a project for South Africa. Yeah, so it's fantastic to be here today at the Linda inauguration. Uh, this project is, uh, is a project we started basically five years back. It was then developed by our South African development partner Simacell and we became involved in 2010 uh, from the Norwegian Scotic Solar side. The specialty about this park is that the, the modules move with the trackers so they produce 20% more compared to if they were fixed. We had to build this project very fast. It was built in under a year. We, we finished uh, three days ahead of schedule. We had a lovely working relationship with the, with the local people. We employed uh, at the peak uh, about 350 of the locals. Om vandaag hier te wees is een verschrikkelijke groot voorrecht. Een voorrecht dat Trilectro genader zou wordt om hier die projecten te kan hanteer samen te hulle, die schakeling kan doen en ons is rarig baie dankbaar daarvoor en ons is verschrikkelijk opgewonden daar om met Skytech geassocieerd te kan worden. We finished it on time and with no disabling injuries. To be able to have trained the people to build up a team that were very successful and managed to produce a quality product in time. And yeah, that's what we're seeing today. It's been an amazing journey with the community. I mean, our first um, encounter was when we came to introduce the, the project to the community where they had no idea what a solar panel even looked like. And for them to be, to be able to, to construct with um, the, the, the plant, um, you know, so successfully, it's been amazing. I had only worked by assembling. That was my ability to do it. And I can one day my grandkids to say, "This was how my mama worked." It was very interesting for me to know everything about solar. Part of this project, being a, an international company, doing the project was more than I could explain in terms of my career advancement. For South Africans it's very important the economic development uh, component of this program. So we've committed to very high and, and uh, obligations. Uh, we've created a lot of jobs. We did the accommodation for them and that really impacted our lives dramatically. Um, it's a special group of people um, motivating everything, everybody around them. So it, 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 it's, it's, it's for me it was, it was a privilege to have them yet. The money they spend with us, um, we've did some good developments into tourism. If I look at my turn over the last two years, Skytech, Skytech contribute a lot. So for this particular event, what we've done is we've incorporated the community through a bidding and artwork um, classes, where over two weeks we held a, a workshops for over 20 ladies in the community and for the kids. So this is not only an opportunity for them to, um, to learn new and acquire new skills, but we've actually discovered a lot of talent, you know, through these workshops. We, we knew nothing about it. Yes, we are closers, but we, we never know we can do something like this, very smart and beautiful. I say thanks to them. Thanks guys a lot. You have brought something that is an experience interesting for us. Here me can I forward gaan. I can say as we slide on as I can look at it. So like my eye being so my coop. I can work that. I can be slide that for my doon for myself and I can maybe see as for coop. It's made such a huge impact in the community. That has been my highlight. They've welcomed us, you know, with open arms, and you know, we're very blessed and, and lucky to have had that. Look forward to working closer with, uh, closely with, um, you know, local communities to uh, to make sure this creates some lasting and sustainable impact. We we had them flying in, uh, twice a week, 
every second, third day perhaps. Most of the flights have been in this particular Pilatus, which is our own one, and it's been great. Got to know everybody, got to know the sites. Sometimes we had bad weather, and maybe our biggest problem will be to, to, to fill up the art fork holes and bear holes on the runway every morning before they come in. We've had a few things of animals on the runway and had to chase them off with an aeroplane, um, which is always fun for the pilot. This is a celebration uh, and recognition of the effort, cooperation, and joint achievement of a great number of individuals, companies, and institutions working together across borders, across cultures, and across the boundaries of the public and private sector in order to provide clean electricity for South Africa for the next 20 years and beyond. Congratulations to all of you who have been involved. Africa is in desperate, desperate need of power, and we believe that solar power and clean energy uh, you know, has, has a big role to play in that. South Africa has been, I think, a pioneer for the market in Africa. On the financing side, we are also joined by, by co-investors, being Stanlib, also Old Mutual. So these are the South African investors. And then from the Norwegian side, we also have Norfund KLP Invest with us. The solar industry in South Africa is now, I would say, an established industry. In Cape Town and Johannesburg, we're building our operational hub for the company globally. The fact that Skatech has you know, even opened a full office in South Africa says a lot about our country. I'm quite privileged to be part of this amazing journey that you know, Skatech has started. Just this year, we brought into operation the first uh, large-scale solar plant outside South Africa, in Sub-Saharan Africa. Uh, West Africa is a key priority for us. We're also active in. Ghana, uh, Namibia, Nigeria and Kenya, uh, Uganda. I found the site very interesting. It's the first time I've been on a solar site. I think it's quite impressive. I haven't been to a plant this size and I think a job well done. Uh, it was a fantastic experience and uh, very privileged to be here and to be part of the project. And uh, I must say it's fantastic to see a project like this actually taking shape and actually producing some energy. Uh, we've introduced the hippos in the Northern Cape, so this, the, the water and the river and nature is very important for us and, and for me to be involved with, with, um, with Skytech. It's just starting the whole process for farmers to, to, to perhaps get more involved themselves, generating solar energy. Well, I think our solar parks in South Africa have the seal of the Karoo strength and the Karoo work ethic. I'm hoping they can be involved in the Karoo for many years to come. I'm